I'm doing a series on the 10 categories of loopholes, and I love loopholes because they are so funny. Now, a loophole is when we're looking for some kind of justification to excuse ourselves from having to stick to a good habit. We're not mindfully making an exception. We're saying that, well, something lets us off the hook. And usually we invoke a loophole at the at the moment, like when right at the moment when we're succumbing to a temptation, we reach around, we discover a loophole, and we use it. Now, one of the most popular loopholes is the tomorrow loophole. And that's the loophole that says, well, it doesn't matter what I do today because tomorrow I'm going to be so good. And as little orphan Annie so uh, often reminds us, tomorrow is always a day away. So it's a very comfortable loophole because it doesn't matter what you do today because there's always tomorrow. And I wrote down some of my favorite uses of the tomorrow loophole. One is, I'll be really frugal in January. So it doesn't matter if I blow my budget in December. I can spend the day hanging out with my friends because starting tomorrow, I'm going to work really hard on my paper. Here's one that comes up a lot. It doesn't matter what I eat today because starting tomorrow, I'm going on a diet. And research shows that when people plan to start a diet the next day, they overeat today. Um, I travel all the time for work, but I'll see more of my children during the summer. Well, what's going to be different in the summer from what's, what's happening today? Um, and sometimes people even fool themselves in thinking if they really overindulge today, that's going to give them more energy tomorrow. Like, oh, I'm going to be super bad today because then I'm going to be even better tomorrow. But the fact of the matter is watch, you know, watching eight hours of television today doesn't make you feel less like watching television tomorrow. So beware of the tomorrow loophole.